All right, guys, so this is the assembly for the XR650L. I'm kind of doing a few steps at a time so you don't get lost. This is one of the uh, retainers for the timing chain. The timing chain goes in right here. There's no reverse or right side. Just goes the normal way with this retainer. It has a screw with a washer. Then a dowel in between and another washer under. This is gets, gets tight, but still this is loose. And this one goes uh, with an impact. This is the top washer. There's a a washer right here. I'm sorry, the nut, the washer that says outside up. And then this uh, gear it, it can go either or away. And then this other gear it goes a single way with the thing to the top not to the bottom and then this gear goes either or away and then under there's another gear you can't see but it's for the timing chain and then uh, out here the pump the pump has a o-ring thick aluminum o-ring under here and two dowels one under here and there's another over here the dowels are the circular type of washer elongated like this and this one there's nothing there's nothing so there's two dowels and an o-ring under here this is for the fuel pump i'm sorry for the oil pump and then uh, out here this is for the shifter mechanism this is a 12 millimeter it was with the spring right here and then this side and then this one goes is a 10 millimeter with this one 10 millimeter the a mesh screen filter so this one whenever you put it like this this is kind of uh, pressed and then you gotta test it with your shifter don't continue until you test it with your shifter because you might have done something wrong and this is not gonna shift right now this is in neutral this one turn because uh, of the magnet on under but this one right now is in neutral I left it in neutral I tried the first Neutral, second, third, all the gears and everything works fine. So everything's working inside. Can't turn this one because of the magnet under. Okay, so this is how you do it. If you have any questions, just shoot me a, a comment and please like. This is uh, so you don't get lost. You have to clean this other side so you can put a new gasket on. Everything's already clean. I uh, use a diesel to clean everything out. There's still some dust because you know it's a uh, doing mechanic, but after that, you have to do oil changes for everything to wash off. Okay, so as of now, this is how it's going. I'm gonna put the clutch right now and um, whatever it needs, and uh, I'll update you with another, another video. Thank you. Thumbs up.